Yo what is up my prankster gangsters, last night I had a crazy dream, I was walking through a bowling alley and someone came up to me and said yo think she part you good at bowling, I told him yeah if I'm on the best I once scored a 43, he was like whoa dude that's sick, well hey can you show me how it's done, I was like yeah sure if I'm anything for a prankster gangster, I walked over to the nearest bowling ball and threw it at the pins, I had all of them, strike, the crowd all roared with applause and confetti came down from the roof. Someone came up to me and said hey man I'm from the Mountain Dew headquarters and since you're so good I'd like to give you a year's supply of Mountain Dew. I was so happy that even my mustache was crying tears of joy. But then it turned into a nightmare fam. I reached for the ball as it came out of the bowling ball dispenser and then I saw it. My reflection in the bowling ball. Except it wasn't me in the reflection. It was Purple Shep. I was Purple Shep. I screamed new into the air and then I woke up covered in sweat. It was the scariest dream I've had in a long long time. I couldn't get back to sleep at all. So fam I've been incredibly stressed today. Seriously I haven't been able to get the image out of my head all day so I thought what is a good thing to clear my head. Then I realized, I could go to the Roblox hotel, that would help me relax. So I decided that's what I'm going to do today fam. Let's go to the Roblox hotel and have the most relaxing day ever. Here we are at the Roblox hotel. It looks quite nice and there is a pretty big crowd here. Now what line do I have to go in? There's the regular line for non-MLG people. There's the sweet line and, and then the fast lane. Well I know I'm MLG so I need the nicest room possible. I deserve that because I deserve to be treated like a king sheep. So I'll buy the sweet line. Alright I am ready to get the most amazing room that I've ever set my eyes on. It will hopefully be like a beautiful mansion with 3 swimming pools and 6 boats inside of each of those pools. And 20 bags of Doritos in each of those boats. And 400 Doritos in each of those bags. I'm getting so excited just thinking about it fam. I've just got to wait here in line for the lady to come serve me. Surely she's going to serve me very soon since I am in the sweet line. Everyone knows that if you pay for these lines you get faster service since you paid for it. So she should be coming over any second now. I just have to be patient. I'm amazing at being patient. Patient is my middle name. Some people call me Pink Sheep Patient Sheep which I think might be my full name. But I can't remember because sometimes I forget my full name. I guess that's what happens when you accidentally drop your birth certificate off a cliff. It was an accident. You know I'm still not getting any service. What is going on here? This is ridiculous. And it's not only me. Everyone else is complaining as well. There is no service to be had here. I think there is one person running the front desk in total. What a bad system fam. How am I supposed to get to my room and relax if I can't even get a room because nobody is working? I don't even think the one person who was working here is here anymore. She probably ran off when she realized how impossible her job is. Why are they not hiring more employees? Or even better have robots do the job instead. Either let people buy their stuff with a computer or build actual robots that look like people and will do the job as if they were just a normal person. How hard could that possibly be? Maybe they're just being lazy. I've even tried ringing the bell. Well sort of. There is no bell so I just typed ding but that should still work. What if I ring the bell louder? Ding. I don't want to be one of those people that goes ding 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 ding. Because those people are always super annoying and obnoxious fam. But I'm getting impatient here. And remember patient is my middle name I think so that's saying something. There's a huge crowd building up outside of the line as well. I think this hotel has just given up on trying to serve people, they just can't do it, that's it. I'll leave and come back in a few hours, I'm sick of waiting here. I'll go to McDonald's to get some McNuggets then I'll come back and get a room. Alright I've taken a few hours to cool off fam so now I think I'm ready to go and try to get a room again. I bet they were just having some temporary problems when I was there but they are most likely fixed now so let's get in line. There's only one other guy here in the sweet line so it shouldn't be too bad. I see there is still only one person working but this time I bet she will go back and forth between the lines like she is supposed to and it will all be fine. Alright come on. We are waiting. This guy in front is right. We did pay over 43 robux for this line. Why are we not getting the service that we deserve? What a waste of money this was. Oh well. If we do end up getting a sweet maybe it will all be worth it. I can just picture it now. Mm -hmm. 
Ah, I just faded into my own dreams for a second there fam, sorry about that, but this line still hasn't moved, hang on, wait, this girl just pushed in line, what, why, why would you do that? Listen here you I don't know if you know but I'm pink sheep which means not only am I pink but I am also a sheep and I worked very hard to get to where I am today which means I worked very hard for even the over 43 robux that it took me to get into this line and I had a very stressful day so I would appreciate if you considered my feelings for once and did not just push him in this lane because I had been waiting here and I deserve it fam. You don't want to mess with me. That's it. I've gotta find something to do while the employees aren't here. There's gotta be something in this hotel other than this. Let's go this way. Okay there seems to be a bar here with some food as well. There is a pool and a spa and a sauna which is nice as well. It's good that it looks like you don't need a room to use this stuff otherwise no one could use it. Upstairs there is a casino and gaming room here which looks pretty cool to be honest. And then also a fitness room. Maybe I could work out while I'm waiting. Get my muscles up fam. Actually let's work on some cardio first. Get on the treadmill and show everyone how fast your boy can run. I was even doing it holding a suitcase. That's how MLG I am. Man I haven't worked out in a while so I am just exhausted. But I should be getting my muscles up. Alright well let's try this bench press instead. Work out my arms. Here we go. Arg. MM. Really working out those muscles. Look at me. I'm so strong. I'm the strongest sheep around. Even my arms are coming off my body. That's how strong they are. They don't even need to be attached to my body to lift the weights. Ah, that's good. Oh look over here. There's a TV. There are so many things that I can watch. Whoa fam. So many channels. Well you know what. I don't really care. I can watch TV anytime. I don't need to be in a hotel to do it. I just want my expensive room. Let's go back down and see if my room is ready. Oh look there's a burger here I better grab that on the way. Now at least I can eat while waiting in line. Okay fam let's try this again. Even more waiting. They can't possibly make us wait any longer. There's a much longer line this time and there's someone actually working at the desk. Amazing. We're one step closer to getting a room. Whoa except there is a huge problem with people cutting in line right now. I can't have any gap between me and the person in front or someone just squeezes their way into the gap. That's ridiculous. Wait the front desk guy left the front desk. Oh he's arresting someone. Whoa fam. This is crazy. Well there's no way I'm getting served anytime soon. I should just go sit down and wait for a few more hours. It can't be too much longer surely. I am fed up with this fam. This is actually the most ridiculous hotel I've ever been to. I have been waiting here for over a day now. Just sitting here waiting to get a room. And either there is nobody at the desk, or someone isn't paying attention, or people are getting arrested, or anything else other than me getting served. So that's it. I'm done. I'm just going to make the most of my time here. I'm going to get revenge. I'm going to get every single piece of food they have. I'm going to take it all and eat it all right in front of them. I won't pay them a cent. I'm just going to take this food. Burgers. Fish. Chips. Steak. Whatever it is I don't care because it's mine now. They can't stop me either because they are understaffed. If they don't have enough employees to run the desk then they won't have enough to stop someone taking all their food. I'll even take drinks, all their soda, everything they've got. They broke me. That was my last straw. I told them not to mess with pink sheep and they did. They messed with me. They will wake up tomorrow and wonder where all their food went. Well I'll tell you where it went fam. I ate it. The pink sheep ate it. And they can't do a thing. So thanks for watching fam. I hope you enjoyed your boy getting revenge on this hotel. I normally don't get like that but they made me wait so long and they didn't even say sorry. At least if they said sorry I might not have gotten so mad. But as Justin Bieber once said, is it too late now to say sorry? Yes it is Justin. It is too late to say sorry. Well anyway fam, I'm even more stressed than I was when I came in. This day didn't go the way I wanted it to at all. Thanks for being with me during it at least. Make sure to smash that like button fam. And also don't forget to subscribe for more MLG Roblox videos.